Defender armor is not just designed to stop the threat, because that's not good enough. You actually have to make sure that when the bullet hits the armor, that the trauma or the back face deformation that the bullet creates to the body is significantly reduced. Back face deformation, 17 and a half. When it comes to body armor, penetration is not the only thing you have to worry about. The actual impact and the trauma to the body from the impact could cause severe injury or even death. That's why Defender Armor was designed to not only stop the bullet, but to make sure that when the bullet actually impacts the armor, the trauma is significantly reduced, the energy is actually dispersed, and that's done through two ways. One, through the fiber core technology, which is when the bullet actually impacts the armor, it's distributed laterally over the surface of the plate. The secondary protection is the foam, and it's a reactive type of foam. When the bullet hits, instead of the trauma going toward the body, it takes it away from the body. The purpose to test against clay is to simulate the human body. The clay is actually a non-Newtonian fluid. It's a Romoplastilina number one clay. It's the most highly sophisticated way to test against body armor. We control the temperature of our clay with two thermal probes, creating a hysteresis so it's conditioned for a few hours before we actually test it. Defender armor has a double curve to it, making sure it's the most ergonomic armor you'll ever wear. That's why we use a clay template against the block to make sure that we accurately measure back face deformation. To ensure the clay is calibrated, we'll make three indentations. After we make our three drops, we're going to use our bridge caliper to measure the indentation. And we've got 24 millimeters there, if you can get that. The reason why reducing trauma is going to change the way the industry looks at armor is because other armor designs are mainly tested against penetration and a very old spec against reducing trauma. But what we did is we took it above and beyond to make sure that our plate actually has a much lower trauma than any other system out there.